Point number six, poor health. If you have a poor health, I mean, it doesn't matter what you know, it doesn't matter what you can do, it doesn't matter what you can accomplish, it's going to be hard. Life is energy. Life is energy. If you don't have energy, if you can't get off the couch, if you can't get out of bed to pursue that dream, if you don't have energy to get out of bed and pursue that dream, and I just sit there, how can I accomplish my goal? And most people who really sit on the sofa and watch TV all day, all night, and stay in bed all day, it's because they don't have energy. Why? Because of poor health. That's why your body is the first capital God gave you. You must take care of your body. You must eat properly. You must drink the right thing. Alcohol is not a water. Your body needs... 70% of water. You must eat good food, not dead stuff. You must exercise. You must breathe normally. You have to wash your hair. It doesn't matter what condition you are in. You may have some sickness. You have to manage that. Matter of fact, if you lose your health, you lose your fortune. If you think I'm joking, ask Steve Jobs. The guy built an empire, but he's gone. He's gone. Don't play with your health. Your health is your first capital. It's better to be broke and healthy than be wealthy and sick in a bed. I'm telling you because... I mean, I, I do chaplain in hospital, and I meet some of the judge, some of the multi, multi-millionaire and billionaire, you know, on oxygen. They're ready to trade everything they have to have a good health. Don't go there. Don't abuse yourself. If you do it, you fail. I see so many companies going down because the CEO the, the CEO health went down. Now the guy is fight to leave. He's, he don't care about company anymore. Take care of yourself. Take care of your health. Number seven.